Stairs can be harder to tackle than they seem. We've all built the same boring staircase up to our glorious base, but sometimes it just doesn't do the job. Today I'm going to show you 5 staircase designs you can use to elevate your builds, be they gargantuan temples or just modest homes. Firstly, Diamond Stairs. In the background you'll see me begin to build up the entrance to an Argosian temple. It's easy to just run stairs straight up, but for a build like this we can do much better. Diamond Stairs are a two path staircase that splits left and right from a single tile, goes up and then turns back to rejoin to a single tile again. I chose to call these diamond due to the diamond like shape left in the center, and these work really nicely. It's a really simple staircase design that is a nice space conscious method of traversing taller builds like this. You can also attach more sections to the sides and the entrance to the staircase, allowing you to place statues, planters and other decorations that will make for a bit more of a lavish looking entrance. Next, long stepped stairs. I've built this arena, and whilst it's looking pretty good so far, it needs an appropriate entrance. It's fairly low to the ground, so a regular staircase won't do. Instead, make a small extension outside the door, and then we can begin on some long stepped stairs. Grab a fence foundation and snap it onto the lowered clip point on the edge of the outward facing foundation. Then, snap a foundation to that lowered fence and repeat until it reaches ground level. You can have each level at whatever length you'd prefer, I went for two tiles each. This creates a long yet fairly shallow walkway that gives this arena a bit more presence and a grander entrance, without having to make the entire build taller or create something too convoluted. Next, slotted stairs designed for an interior. Stairs inside a build are a bit more troublesome as you have limited space to work with, so often they just go straight up. However, we can still make this more attractive. Firstly, place a wall in line with the staircase, and in this case I'll make a small hatch for this storefront. Then add a doorway to access the staircase, and you can then begin to use inverted sloping sides to build the slot. This is basically a sort of viewport that runs on one or both sides of the staircase and provides a bit of depth whilst not fully closing off the staircase, nor leaving it too open. Inside a finished build, this helps to better segment and manage your space while creating an attractive alternative to the usual blocked or floating staircases. Next, for your porches, half stairs. Stage stairs from the debaucheries of Diketo DLC are a great way to augment your porch on smaller homely builds. Firstly, use the fence foundation trick to drop a foundation to roughly half the height of a regular foundation. Then, grab your stage stairs and place them atop the foundation to meet or sit just below the porch. Fill the gap with matching wooden stairs as needed and you now have a subtle but more attractive entrance to your porch. You could also build out another foundation either side and add stage corner stairs. I'm usually not a massive fan of this myself, but it's something you may wish to do for your own home. Finally, splitting stairs. We've got this grand, tall storm glass build here and it needs an aptly grandiose entranceway. Therefore, we are using these splitting stairs which divert from each other to then later rejoin closer to the entrance. Build out a rough plan with either regular or fence foundations, plotting out where you'd like the stairs and walkways to go, leaving an empty space in the centre. I usually go with a square but this could be a rectangle, or if you want to use wedges, you could do this with circular shapes as well. Try to space out your stairs decently well, otherwise this can end up feeling really unbalanced, unless that's what you're going for. Cover any gaps with sloping sides and fences, and then place your staircases. This creates a fairly large and grand entranceway with a large plateau in the middle, which you can use as a social space, or in this case, a luxurious entrance garden with a statue rising from within. In my opinion, splitting stairs work better for large builds and are good at taking up a considerable amount of space and making your build feel more important. And there we have it, 5 ways to build better stairs. Staircases are really easy to overlook as something that can be made more decorative, as they're mostly utilitarian rather than a design choice. That being said, in my opinion, stairs are just as important as your walls and roofs, and hopefully these designs can help you to improve your own staircases. If you enjoy my content, all the links to my Twitch, Twitter, Discord, Patreon, Host Havoc affiliate page, NordVPN discount and NordPass discount are available in the description below. However, of course, you can simply just leave a like, a comment or subscribe, any of those are very greatly appreciated. Patrons get a bunch of nice benefits including sneak peeks of videos, your name in every video, custom made wallpapers in 1080p and 4k resolutions, full size build blueprints, discord roles and more. 
As always, a massive thanks to our patrons Sadarlot, Randar, Connor, Ivy, Torn, Ill-Fated, CoffeeMan04, Jacques, Marion Ladd, Ronald, Baron, Ghosty Pants, Ryan, Ben, Alfric, Eagle Rose, Melanie, and X Screechers X. As always, thanks for watching, take care, and I'll see you soon.